good morning my lovely people how are you all doing i earlier dropped my child at this school and left here my car and went for my morning routine of jogging i have so far done let me see if i can show you these are kilometers yeah it is inverted i don't know how to show you 9.16 is what i've done so about uh, nine point something kilometers and today is my fourth week i'm going to wait to see in a month how much i have lost yeah this is how i'm beginning my amazing video <laughs> It is going to be running, I don't know for how long because uh, I need to go to town to pick a few things for shopping for my children who are in secondary school. Uh, this weekend is their visiting day. So it is what I'll be doing. So there is travel, there is checking on them, their progress and uh, and what and give them some tips on how to perform well then i return yeah it is of course uh i don't know how long it is but it is about five hours drive and i'll travel at night i arrive in the morning so let's do this guys uh, why I'm shopping here in the city center is that I want to utilize my time when I reach in Barara city. I would literally find what I'm going to buy there in that city. But I want to save on time to go for the school meeting. Then after the meeting we shall talk with my daughter uh, and we chat a bit. Then I run to the boys' school, also in the neighborhood. And I see him also, then ah, I come back to the city, Kampala city. The capital. The capital city. The capital city of Uganda. I don't know where I'll, I'll visit first. I might go to Ontario first, then go to Mary Hill later depending on the time i arrive because the meeting at mary hill starts at 10 so like if i arrive at 8 i would use those two hours to see my son at Intare. so keep watching to the end and see how the story will roll so this is where i'm going to weigh my weights yeah this So this hospital is in Chireka. So guys, I am super excited because I lost six kilograms so good progress. Excited! <laughs> yeah, that is it. I am excited because I have lost six kilograms in a month, four weeks. So let's start another week next Monday. So yeah, guys, that is it. I have lost six kilograms in four weeks that is progress so next week i'll begin another month counting so i exercise monday to friday i rest saturday and sunday okay let me go and freshen up and begin my day hey my lovely people now it is much later i had a good shower and now it is lunch time and i intend to use my one hour to do shopping for my children uh, my sisters are suggesting that we hang out this evening i don't know how possibly i can pull it off and guys to meet usually is to be intentional like literally we 
are all busy people but i don't know whether we will pull it off today because personally i have to park organize because i'm traveling in the night so i don't know how the coffee is going to be but if they confirm i will <laughs> i don't know how i'm going to do it i will tell them that i'll join them later i'll see how the whole thing will uh, join the dots but so far now the plan is to go to town and pick a few things to take for my children in schools uh, because they are in boarding section so the actually everyone the schools they are in everyone is a border like they stay at school no day scholars so i'm going to see i'm just going to pick quick quick then i come back but i lost some videos i lost some content because i think my sd card has a problem or my memory card got a problem i do not know so maybe i might go and pick one in town i buy a new one but um when i was talking to one of my friends dennis he works with me here in um in uh, ict section he said he could try to see if he can retrieve them if he retrieves them that will be good for me if he doesn't i had uh, i had some scanty like broken pieces uh, maybe I'll put them together and you watch what I had prepared for you yeah and we continue moving but otherwise let me go and check how far he has gone uh, though it is lunch time maybe he's not on his desk but um, I'll find out and see if they are If there is any help he's uh, giving me so yeah and usually here at my workplace we get students who come to do a tour to see what is going on so yeah hello guys how are you which school is this huh? Nkowe, St. Elizabeth okay so they are from St. Elizabeth in Kowe uh, so these uh, students that we get are uh, doing uh, a study tour. They are inspired into what they will study in the future. To be guided in what they will study, especially if they are science subjects, uh, they see where it will lead. That is like practical part of it. Yeah, so that uh, they know Ale, which road to take. And how is the quality when you go to edit? How heavy are the videos? Like, why is it? Uh, these ones are uh, quite heavy. Mm. But usually 4K is heavy. Mm. So I, now I am not seeing even that setting of the 4K and the light. But 4K is better. It is heavy. It is heavy, but it's better, better graphics. Mm. Let's first see if it will go first. But you see, like now to to, to upload it, like this Ugandan internet yeah, takes the Eh? Yeah. guys, this is my friend Dennis. He's the one helping me here yeah. to recover my videos. So. Yeah, so far it is at 50, 52%. Let's see how it goes and I see if I'll have them. If not, life continues as I continue creating, <laughs> creating more videos, guys, for you. So that is it. Uh, let me step out to town and I'll be back shortly. Guys, I'm going to jump on a border border as always or a motorbike so that I run 
to run these errands uh, actually I have been advised that I don't need uh, an SD card I think some uh, uh, my camera was uh, formatted or other settings I think my daughter played with my <laughs> my cameras it got some issues like new settings which wouldn't flow with my phone so editing has been a challenge uh yeah so that is it so now let me go for children's shopping briefly and i come back border javad who speak meta who speak random pity random video here we go guys um, yeah, so I have set off and I'm going to do this in the quickest time possible uh, it is not much maybe I need powdered milk and uh, hard corn those wrap wrap things I don't know what you call them in your countries but here they call it wrap so simple snacks dry and I'm here supporting uh, my friend. Uh, she's, um, she's she sells nuts and uh, uh, maize. <laughs> uh, I don't know what they call it, this one. Guys, look. Even when I try at home, it doesn't come out nicely. So even it gets more expensive <laughs> to buy nuts, then go and sit on the stove and. Uh, start roasting g nuts these are roasted g nuts let me show you and they come out well like this it is usually tricky so we leave it for the generals like esther <laughs> she's my friend here esther say hello hello how are you guys i always support such local women so that they also find survival in this the, in this city so I'm going to buy a few to take for my children. Uh, then I also go and buy a few things in the maybe wholesale shop or supermarket. So that is it. Guys, this is city life here. So guys, I'm done with the shopping, the snacks. <laughs> yeah, I usually feel for women who go out and fend for their families to get uh, food for their children though it is not allowed to sell on streets but when you find them you give them the best support you can and not just supporting but she has amazing amazing snacks uh, which takes time like when I try at home usually it takes a lot of time you even wonder how much time she spends to to make uh, to roast genus and also deep fry the maize preparing it when I try it at home uh, the corn usually gets hard yet I, I first preheat it then deep fry it but it doesn't come out nicely like for this lady so I always come to support her yeah so now let me slope downtown to get um, maybe a few things yeah then i go back to office
guys i'm just crossing in the city yeah just moving i decided to walk so right now i'm on kampala road at boulevard what is this i don't know its name yeah but i think it is called kampala boulevard something yeah the sun is hot hot oh my god so just moving around this is Papa. Ah, next is cairo bank Whew, i'm already tired because i'm carrying luggage <laughs> I think I'll need a border. Street life in Kampala City. My mom, I'm going to go to the city. I'm going to go to the city. I'm just moving around. Uh, I'm going to cross here. the move guys so these are the streets of Kampala downtown yeah so <laughs> just no I am just sloping down uh, I'm going guys if you're uh, my local subscriber or of Uganda you know where Chikuboland is that's where I'm sloping Guys, I'm crossing here at Mutasa Cathedral. Yo. Guys, if you are not a people person, you can't come here. <laughs> it is overcrowded. Look. Guys, <laughs> So guys, this is the lane that I'm coming to. I usually buy around here. Uh, scholastic materials, kitchen things. So, so crazy, crazy, crazy. So, I'm going to pick uh, milk for these children. So guys, this is where we shop. Uh, 
Uh, I don't know. So guys, let me check. So right now I am rushing to catch up <laughs> with my sisters. Uh, I managed to drop my daughter to the dad so that they can go home. I'll find them. Guys, it is a Friday. T G I F. So I am leaving office. That is the sunset over those houses. So it is in the evening and it is weekend has begun let me go and hang out with my sister briefly then I go home to park so guys this is where we are nightlife <laughs> Hi. wow So these are the things we have so far. Shops. Uh, just in addition to what we already have. Can we show biscuits to Kazanga? So she needs these pens. Nataraj, that's what she asked for. A box file. I don't know where they are. I think I'll have to ask. Um, a scrubbing brush. A feet scrubbing brush. I don't know what that is. And uh, some peanuts. I'm looking for... Hey, my lovely people, guys, I am here. This is uh, the main entrance of Ntare School. By 6 that I was here. And I am going to see my son briefly, then uh, rush to Mary Hill. I see my lovely daughter as well. So, yeah, that is today's activity. The weekend is all spent in all motherhood <laughs> stuff so yeah i traveled by a night bus so i am ali uh, no, I yeah 
Look, this is where I am. Oh, I've just had a chat with my son Nicholas. Say hello. Hi. <laughs> Uh, so we are just uh, moving to his dormitory. I check on his work, then I say bye. Yeah, so kindly comment, share, like, and subscribe as I move to Mary Hill to see another one. Guys, I'm right here just amazed on how these children do housework Saturday. Today is Saturday, so they do housework, but literally they take out everything. The cases, the beds, the mattresses, like everything. <laughs> I can imagine how hectic this work is. So guys, look at that. They have to clean by removing all the cases, the beds, the bed covers, everything has to come out. Then they clean and re-enter them. Yeah, so let me go and look at his books. Then, then I set off. So why do they cut in like this? Prevent light from entering. Sleep better. Uh. But the ones who sleep down are S4s and S3s. Better, your best. Yeah. 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 Better your best to be a model school for excellency to ensure continued improvement of all round quality performance, character building, and self esteem in learners. Nicholas, are you picking those words to be one? <laughs> yeah? To be that kind of a student. All right, guys, this is how Ntare school looks like. So we are done now. I am headed to Mary Hill. Guys, motherhood swing is on. Like I have to be everywhere. <laughs> I see few parents have also started to come to check on the progress of their children. I think today is career guidance for senior ones. Yeah, so that is it. That is it. So right here, I am at Mary Hill. This is how it looks as you enter. And the students are all over the compound. The parents are waiting as the, the meeting is getting concluded. So that is it, guys. Let me find my daughter. We have a final chat. And I get started on the road. Let me find her, then we chat a bit. And I'm carrying my work. This is my laptop and the charger. So let me find how we have a final chat. Then we leave. Kindly comment, kindly subscribe and share. And I'll definitely see you on my next one. Bye bye.
So guys, let me end my video here as I run to the bus park. I'll see you in Kampala on another video. Bye-bye.